Hey friends, welcome back to a new Dive in Life tutorial. Um, as you know from these tutorials, they are short and powerful. And this week we're going to talk about the return tracks and how you can route those into each other. It's very dangerous, but it's a lot of fun. So let me open my return tracks here. And you'll see that I have a lot of them. I always have small, medium and big reverb, then a few delays and two crazy chains. Uh, one being like with a flanger and delay and a phaser and a vocoder and whatnot. And the cool thing is with normal return tracks, you can send um, a sound to a return track and then the return track will have an effect on it, which is usually 100% wet. And you can actually yeah, send sound to this reverb, for instance, and have the reverb on this return channel. So another thing that you could do, because you see that the return channels have sends, you can actually send return channels to each other and into themselves, which is pretty interesting because you'll get a really, really interesting result. Namely that you can um, create feedback loops within your project and then record those into your uh, DAW as uh, sort of like ambient loops or effects loops. And you can think of many, 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 many uh, variations. So let's uh, try it out. So first thing to do is add a limiter to your master because this is dangerous. You know, you're going to create feedback loops if you forget one uh, send and it's it's going into oblivion you know once it's going up in volume you really need to close back the sense otherwise um, you get a lot of loud sound so we can right click here and this is also the reason why the sense are disabled by uh, by default so watch out with this enable all sense enable all sense enable all sense enable all sense Enable all sense, enable all the sense, enable all the sense, etc. So now they're all enabled and we can start uh, routing them. But before that, I will create an audio channel here. And this audio channel will um, go to the master, but we'll get, it, we'll get its, um, uh, uh, its um, uh, si signal from the sense. So I'm going to send uh, sense C, for instance, to this this track and I can arm it uh, I can add this crazy chain maybe to go there uh, maybe send this uh, send there as well and uh, let's say maybe this one as well and then we can start actually recording and sending sends to each other and you'll hear as soon as I'll open them that they will start going um, into each other like with the sound the sounds will go uh, over each other and into each other and um, that's gonna be fun let's uh, let's check what's happening so now I'll send like C to F Obviously, this is endless fun, you know, you can create all these different combinations. Please, again, be careful with this because you're going to get a lot of, lot of um, uh, feedback loops uh, going on in your music. But if we listen to the result and we play, this is what we recorded. So you get all these interesting effects like this. And of course, depending on what you're sending, um, you know, maybe I um, I also have the delay of one four. I get a bit of this rhythm. If you don't want this, you just don't send it, and just you just work with with reverbs and sort of spacious effects to to create your own drones, you know, and to have uh, have fun with this. And you can then you know, like select these guys and use them as effects in your music. So um, this is how you can send return channels 
into each other, please be careful with it because you might ruin your ears or your speakers. So make sure to always add a limiter first and have fun and try different settings. You know, you can use resonators, you can use phasers and flangers and chorus and delays and reverbs and then send them all through each other and, and then, um, yeah, use the balance with the, with the sense. Um, so I hope you find this inspiring and enjoying. Um, if you like what I do, please hit subscribe on the on the subscribe button so you can um, be notifi notified whenever I create a new video. Also, check out lessonsinlife.com. I do master classes every now and then. Uh, I have preset packs available on the Gumroad page, um, which is uh, the link is available uh, down below under the video where you can find preset packs for Serum or preset packs for uh, Ableton's Analog and so on. Uh, I do dive in live sessions every Wednesday. I have artists in my show, uh, which you can also find on this YouTube channel, uh, where they show uh, bits of their projects and uh, we talk about music and life. So uh, thank you for tuning in and uh, I'll see you at the next one.